So, someone dropped off a message for you. It's on the desk. Not before he gave it a shake to see if there were coins inside. I, I was worried they would fall out. Yeah, sure. Cameron. <sighs> the house won't clean itself, Uncle. What's in here, by the way? I don't think I've been in here. I can't have Mother living in this hole. We've got to get out of here. This is the same cheese that was here a year ago. Oh God! Uh, I I I have to be somewhere else, somewhere else that is away from that thing. I think I'll put this here. It was a special delivery, but I can't use it. Okay, this sounds a bit like an ambush, but I can handle those. Okay, let's see what we have here. It could be a genuine offer. It could also be an ambush. Either way, I'm going. Okay. But, wait a moment. And what we have is... Health potions. Interesting. Where was it? There. They could have made the hitbox a... Uh... Oh! <laughs> Pre <laughs> press the space bar. Hmm. Well... I suppose it could be nice to have in an emergency. And this could be a bit useful. There. What was I thinking? Thinking about something. Oh well. Mm, let's take you. You and you. Isabella, you captain a ship. That's a lot of men to handle, but for you to command. Well, aren't you just adorable fumbling for a topic? You say that like I'm harmless. As harmless as a pup that will someday grow into its fangs and sink them deep. Sure, keep teasing. I'll show you how much of a pup I am. I know. That's why I do it. Hmm. Oh, wait. Interesting. Oh wait, that was. Hi. Yes, you. Hi. We have found neither hide nor hair of the lad, Fainril. I can only think he has fallen victim to demons or slavers. I found this. It was addressed to you. It seems to be from your daughter. My daughter? Then... You know what she is. How she died. When I traced her to that warehouse, I should have forced her into the circle. My own weakness in the face of her pleas is what destroyed her. It is why I urged Ariani not to give in when Fainriel wished to hide. If only I had been so strong for Olivia. You have my sympathies. Do not fear the Templars finding out. Thank you. She is at peace now. I would not wish to see her name smeared while her ashes are still warm. Sorry, man. I wish I could have held. Really. Oh, wait. Huh. An info box. 
plate thing. I heard you rescued Kara. Thanks for looking out for us. Oh, no problem. I do not like Templars or what you do. I think you could be improved at least, but uh, what can I say? This is yours, if I'm not mistaken. Where did you get this? It's just what I need. Thank you. you seem like you need help. Ah, welcome, my dear friend, to Sol's shop. My name is Solivitus. Please take a look around. My apologies in advance. Our shelves are a bit bare at the moment. Actually, if you're interested, I could use a bit of help to remedy that. Remedy that? Potions shop. You, my good man, are priceless. <laughs> the pun wasn't intentional, although I may use that next time. <laughs> Puns. It's too dangerous to leave the city of late, and the substances I require for my creations are, of course, elsewhere. Well, that's part of the course. You can find them. You'll be compensated for your time, have no fear. I'll also give you first pick of my new creations. Sure. Make up a list of what you need, and I'll keep an eye out for you. Perfect. A discount on everything in the shop, Sirrah. I am glad to stand here day after day. It is predictable. Creepy. Oh, you need to level up, by the way. Didn't notice that. Sorry. Maybe I should check your equipment first. See what we got. Nah, good enough as it is. Definitely. Definitely. Now I need to level you up. I almost forgot that. <laughs> okay. Definitely. Eh, sure. Oh, that's nice. That's really nice. More damage. Tempest and extra damage. Could really use that. Thank you, my friend. Only one thing on the list left. Oh. Okay, so that's what I've been picking up. Was wondering. It is the duty of every mage to train in the circle, so we do not bring danger to our home. Okay. Up there. Wait, where did we come from? Did we sail all the way down here? Pharrell. You look like a man I once dueled. He was a little intimidated by my reputation as a vicious pirate, but rose to the challenge. He looked like me, you say? It went on all night, under the stars, the waves lapping at our ankles. On the beach? In the surf? How did you get a proper footing? We didn't. There was quite a bit of tumbling around, and we were soaked and sore by the time the sun came up. Did you win? I managed to get on top in the end, 
but I considered it a tie. I'm not sure what she talked about. I mean, I'm not dumb. Oh, it's just was she really talking about dueling or was she having sex with that man? I'm not certain. Yes and no. So piss off. Oh, you're talking with that guy. <laughs> Interesting. My companions are now interacting with other people around. Okay. Let me pass. I have business with the dwarf Javaris and your Arishog. The short mouth, yes. Enter if you must, Basra. Sure. You go on ahead. I would rather not. An awkward time to run off, Isabella. Ah, you know I'd never leave you. It's just that I really have to leave. Now. Oh, okay. Huh. Wow, well, okay. That's suspicious. So, Kunari have horn. Hmm. Didn't know that. Ah, my right hand arrives. Summon your era, shock. The bargain is done. This ought to be About interesting. time you showed. I've been here for hours. Well, you know how it is. Killing stuff. Takes time. That guy's got some pawns. Not sure how effective they are pointing that way. Maybe if we bend over and run at people. Lustrious Aeroshock. I am here to report that your hated Talvashoth were felled, one and all. Right? Uh, yes, yes. Yeah, yes, yeah, they yeah, were. yeah, yeah, they were. So, I'm ready to open negotiations for the explosive powder. Hey, Who um. Agreed? No. He's not getting it. Say something. The Talvashoth camped at the wounded coast are dead. You won't honor your bargain. There is no bargain to honor. His offer for the Gatlock was refused. Ah, so, so as I suspected. Worth when he has none. I broke my beard getting your outcasts killed. You hired someone more competent and now stand in their shadow pretending it is yours. <laughs> True. You demean his accomplishment. Get out of my sight before I bother lifting my sword. I did his dirty work. That debt stands. Does it, dwarf? You said yourself there was no bargain. I'm not getting a sodding thing out of this. This human did what you could not, something I did not expect of any outsider, and you have involved me. Oh my. If you made a bargain for the Talvashoth, that debt for their lives will be honored. It's not at all. Take your coin, take whatever. Hornhead Oxman and Mongrel Dawn Lords, suck your own powder and blow your head off, sod it. You will leave as well, human. There's no more coin for you here. Oh, okay. Thanks! Oh nice, you're a little info monolith standing around here with information about the Konari. That's nice of you! Let's just go up here.